I wanted to take a quick look at something that seems to be the biggest complaint when it comes to Bondi, and that's the instructions that are provided. First off, they come in the case, and you'll immediately see they're a bit of a jumbled mess. Personally, mine also even came adhesive stuck to the case itself, which means it was rather difficult to get them out without even tearing it. I'm not sure if that's something that would happen for everyone, but it was where it was with mine. Now, there are multiple sides of this, and it's multiple languages all over the place. It's not organized in the best manner, but once you find what you need, you can start to understand it. But it's not the cleanest in the world. It's not set up the best. Some of the stuff's vertical, some of it's horizontal. There's a reason that a lot of people, even people who enjoy the product, recommend that you look up online how to better use it. You could get a basic idea of what you need to do through these instructions, but they are not the best. They jump around languages a bit too often in random places. They are organized in a odd manner. You can get a basic understanding about how the entire product works through this, but I'd still recommend looking at more stuff rather than going with the provided instructions. It tells you some of the basic stuff that you can do, but again, you're probably better off trying to find more information online, videos, and even going through their own websites and sources. At the bottom, you will see a link to their Facebook, which is a good start for further information like that. Other than that, there isn't a lot more to the instructions. It's a good place to get started, but I would highly recommend that you find further instructions elsewhere if you do not understand right off the bat how to use this product. It is not something that you want to be doing without under using without understanding what you are doing, as with any adhesive, especially one that has special properties like Bondike. Just be careful with it, and know what you're doing.